Hello, welcome to TechShirmit. In this session, we will learn about a process through which we can view or display the constant field in debug mode. So if you remember like uh, whenever we are trying to debug the program uh, which consists some uh, constant value and uh, that values if we want to display at the time of debugging then it shows some error which is identified does not exist. So how we can view the values which is stored in those constant variables. So mainly we will discuss about that. So firstly I will show you the program and that issue then we will find the solution for it. So I'm opening this uh, program into edit mode. So here what I'm doing as usual I'm writing the code in fully free format and firstly I'm setting the control options which is no debug IO and SRC STMT. This is mainly for the debugging purpose. Now below to that what we are doing we are declaring one variable and one constant. So variable name is uh, user ID which is of numeric type of length 4 and we have initialized some value to it which is 50. And below to that we are declaring one constant named as const1 and we are storing the value as abc in it. And then we are just simply ending our program by setting the last record on. Okay. So we are not going to display any value here because we, we are just creating this program for debugging purpose. So that's why we are not doing anything here inside the program. So now I'm compiling it and after compiling we will take this into debug mode and then we will see the problem that we usually face. So let me compile this with source. So I'm compiling it with source. It is compiled. Now we will take this program in debug mode. So for that I'm hitting the command strdbg. This is my program name and this is my library name. And now setting these two options as yes and then it will take some time and then it will uh, take us to the debug screen. And on that debug screen we will set the breakpoint and when see, uh, then we will simply call this program again. Okay, so now it is in debug mode. So I'm setting the breakpoint as BR1 and then pressing F10 and now I'm calling it again to check the output. So press F10. So right now if I want to check this uh, value, the display this variable. So what I can do, I have two options. Either I will place my cursor here or press F11. So it will give me this uh, value. Okay, so it is showing that this value is 50. And if I want to go with second approach, which is eval and user ID, so it will show the value. That is correct. But same thing if I want to check the value for this const one variable, then it will not show me the value. It shows this error. Identified does not exist. Okay. Same goes with that eval const because whenever we are pressing F11, it is uh, hitting that same command eval const1 so it will again give this error okay so this is a problem like suppose uh, we are we have a big program where we are using multiple constant field and we want to check this these values in at the time of debugging then if it shows this kind of error then it is a big problem for developer so how to resolve that so to resolve that you just need to add one control option in your program so let's see how so here you have to write just simply debug then inside the parenthesis you have to write constants okay and then simply close your parenthesis so this is how we can solve this problem so just after that you have to compile it again with the source to take this program in debug Now we have to hit the command end debug because we have already started the debug. Now we will start the again, again the debug. strdbg, then my program name, my library name, these two options. So once it will, uh, it will go inside the debug mode, we will set the breakpoint again and then we will try to again see the values and this time we will be able to see both the values variable as well as constant so i'm setting the breakpoint one on line one and now i'm calling it again now if i press f10 and if i 
place my cursor on this field for variable and press F11 so it, it is showing the variable value but this time we will be able to see this value also so placing my cursor on const1 pressing F11 so it is showing the value which is ABC okay and same goes with eval if I do the eval const when so it is showing me the value so this is how we have solved the issue of uh, displaying the values of constant field inside the debug mode so this is very useful uh, control option because most of the time we need to check the fields which is in constant uh, variable inside the debug mode so if you want to do the same thing then you have to use this uh, small command which is debug and inside that you you have to pass this value star constant so i hope this trick is uh, clear to all of you and yeah that's all for this session in the upcoming session we will discuss few more things so thank you for watching tech share method